Burlington Fish Hatchery lies in the scenic valley downstream of Crawford State Fishing Lake and State Park in southeastern Kansas, Crawford County. One of four state fish hatcheries belonging to Kansas Wildlife and Parks, this 30-pond complex produces game fish for statewide distribution. A modern fish house provides indoor raceways and spawning capabilities. Hatchery manager Randy Nelson is one of the state's most experienced biologists and he's justifiably proud of this Kansas Wildlife and Parks facility. Uh, I came here in 1977, February 77. So I've been here 33 years and seen a lot of changes. Uh, the Department of Wildlife and Parks uh, has spent a lot of money on this place uh, fixing it up and doing a lot of renovations, building a new fish house, new water lines, new drain lines, new harvest structures, and uh, it's really fixed up nice right now. And uh, we've uh, been producing a bunch of fish out of here over the last uh, 30 years. That this is well, 35 years that the state's operated it. Barlington is one of three Kansas fish hatcheries that raise walleye by artificial spawning methods and is expected to produce about 5 million fry this year. The unique gravity feed water supply from the nearby lake helps make this hatchery one of the least expensive to operate. Inside the fish house, a recirculating water system aerates eggs and holds water temperature at an ideal 60 degrees. Hatching jars are each filled with up to 300,000 fertilized walleye eggs from Hillsdale Reservoir. They hatch in about 11 days. Eggs are checked several times daily and dead ones are siphoned off to help avoid possible disease problems. Hatching fry swim upward in the jars and are carried by moving water into tanks where they further develop. Then they are moved into rearing ponds where they feed on zooplankton for five weeks. When they've grown to about an inch and a half long, the fingerlings are stocked into Kansas reservoirs. Farlington is also an important producer of blue and channel catfish. Up to 25,000 pounds of channel cat fingerlings pass through the fish house and are graded to size for later distribution. An overhead crane helps move and weigh the young fish with a minimum of physical handling. Other fish species raised at Farlington include red ear sunfish, hybrid sunfish, sauger, sogeye, striped bass, and wipers. As with all Kansas fish hatcheries, tours are available at Farlington by special arrangement. Seeing the work of a fish hatchery provides fascinating insight into the maintenance of Kansas fish resources. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.